Yeah, welcome. So this is our first True North Music event for, oh, oh, what was it, 27 months, something like that. And it's going to be a really special one, so thank you so much to everyone for coming out. I'm Maria Wallace and my business name is True North Music and I'm a freelance music promoter here near Huddersfield and tonight we're at the Carlisle Institute in Meltham. I'm a grassroots music promoter, I've been doing that for about seven years but we have had a bit of a two year break because of the pandemic so haven't had any real life concerts in that time but up to now I've put on 50 gigs in Yorkshire, some in Sheffield and about half or so here in Kirklees, uh, mostly here in Meltham and a few at Marsden, uh, Huddersfield, Honley and yeah so tonight's going to be like our first live concert back since the pandemic. I'm so happy and excited that we're welcoming another band here to Meltham and it's going to be Jake Blunt. It's going to be a very special gig. So my name is Jake Blunt. Uh, I come from Washington DC originally but make my home in Providence, Rhode Island these days. Uh, my band is from all over the place. My fiddler is from New Zealand and my guitarist is from Pennsylvania and my bassist is from New Orleans. So it's a joining of forces from many different regions and places, but we have a good time together. One of the interesting things about bluegrass is that depending on where you go and who you talk to, it means a few different things. Uh, in a lot of the United States, the type of music that we play would not be called bluegrass, it would be called old time. Um, and bluegrass evolved out of old time. Old time evolved from the combination of uh, music that came through from the British Isles and came from Africa and existed already in the Americas from the indigenous cultures there. Uh, formed this string band repertoire where the banjo, which is an inf instrument of African descent, uh, joined forces with the fiddle uh, and eventually later on with the guitar uh, and formed this string band sound that you still hear. It's gone through a few different iterations over the course of its lifetime, bluegrass being the latest and most common one. But it's that old school dance community music. Maria is, is a tireless champion of, of bluegrass music, has been working with all of my friends for many years, so I was super excited that you agreed to put this together for us. This tour is just awesome. Somebody's round, somebody's round. It's just really exciting to be back and hopefully we're getting our live music series uh, going again and the next thing we've got is late June that we'll have a bluegrass band from Colorado, Still House Junkies, here in June and then we do have plans for the autumn and we also quite often have UK bands, you know, blues, Americana and so yeah we're just hoping to be able to kind of gather again and enjoy live music with the local community and yeah it's really great to be featured on Kirklees TV so Thanks very much, Milton, and to all the team.